Hey guys, welcome back to Unmedicated and Dysfunctional. I'm Kenz. This is Life is Strange Before the Storm. Um, last episode was about four episodes long for us, so I believe this is actually going to end up being our last episode. Um, last time, we finally huh. kissed Rachel, Rachel Amber. Really wasn't over well, she kissed us. She met me. She kissed us. Well, um, that in the bud. Yeah, so now we are awkwardly sitting and, or we're not sitting yet. We are awkwardly in her house, um, going to help her mother set the table. Everything about this house so, is nicer, cleaner, better, and more expensive than mine. Yeah, Rachel very Which clearly. isn't saying much, but Rachel and I both had great childhoods. Yeah. Mine just ended a little before hers. I guess. So Rachel clearly comes with uh, not necessarily a better background, but a wealthier background than than we do. So we're gonna go ahead and um, if I open this, will skeletons come spilling out? <laughs> I guess help with uh, no setting the the table. Lots of shiny dishes, though. Which is really oh oh yay a text. Hey, Price, sorry about what I said to you earlier. You were only trying to help. No way, I'm sorry, Drew. Why does everybody always have my number in these games? I don't get it. Tell him I said, hey, we'll do... Uh, oh, Elliot! Oh, we forgot about Elliot! Oh, tell them both I'm pulling for him. Uh, Drew will text you in a bit. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, medals. Cool. Uh, Chloe, the show is starting. Got great seats. Where are you? Oh, you'll see. Oh, he saw us at the show. Oh yeah, because we were in the show. Okay, so we've got some, whoa. We've got a lot of, okay. So it looks like we've got kind of backgrounds on everyone here, which I'm, uh, I'm not gonna go, Ooh, we have one that's missing though. Who are we missing? Damon. So I don't know if we missed a character or what, but um, yeah, so we do have all that. Ooh, we've got more on Max too. First I jacked Samuel's keys, then used my Jedi powers to get past Skip into the dorms, uh, took the tour of Drew's room. Uh, anyway, I found the cash, but then Drew and Mikey showed up. So this is kind of like her journal. Remember that easy job, Frank? Yeah, not quite. So, um, I guess these are kind of like letters to Max. Yeah, more toil. Hell equals empty. Love, Chloe. The FML. So I survived, just in case you worried about me. You totally weren't, but it wasn't easy. I had to remember what to say and where to go and not to flip off everyone in the audience. Yeah. Yeah. So now this is... Yeah. Put your thoughts in me. Wow. So she's really writing out her whole story to Max and... Hoping that Max gets it or sees it or in one way or another. It's really sad. It's really sad if you think about it. I wonder if this will be the most expensive thing I've ever eaten off of. <laughs> Besides my computer, of <laughs> course. Yeah, maybe we should talk to her mom real quick, hey see there. what she wants us to do. This is Amber. Chloe, I'm so glad you're joining us tonight. Uh, setting the table. So, you putting me to work, or what? Yes. If you could please take four plates from the cupboard and set them on the table. Absolutely. Uh, what if I can't? Excuse me? You said if I could. Never mind. Awkward. You're a riot, Chloe. Yep, that's me. All right, Chloe, you've set the, the table without ruining I don't someone's wanna, marriage before. I don't want to not talk to her as it's much as I can the table with you. because I'm nervous that anything that I say is just gonna backfire. So I'm just gonna try not to say as much as I possibly can to her and just do... I'm gonna be compli compliant and just do what I'm told in, in this case to uh, make sure they don't... Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting nervous here. Hi, Mom. Chloe, Justin Williams' mom just called me. Uh, were you in the play tonight? I would have liked to see that. Kind of just happened. I know it was last minute. I'm glad you're doing well. It would be nice to see you tonight. Are you coming home? Please, Chloe, I miss you. Oh, it's a little bit sad. 
It's a little sad. Okay. Maybe we should open this. We're gonna need some glasses. I think. Glasses. Damn. Which ones though? The ambers are fancy as shit. Yeah. Why does Rachel oh, I know why she wants to leave. Okay, uh maybe I should ask her what else she wants. Hey, Rachel's mom. Hey Rachel's mom, Rose, Rose. Yes, Chloe? Uh what next? Plates? Check. Anything else? Actually, could you be a dear and ask Mr. Amber what he'd like to drink with dinner? Sure! I will be a dear. Sure! Talking to James. It's as ironic as that she said be a dear because... And scumbag, I should yeah. be fine. Yep, 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 yep. We got this. We can do it! Hiya, Mr. Amber. Chloe! What can I do for you? Yeah, what do you... Uh, we just want a drink. I just, what What's do you want to drink? Advice, Mr. Amber? I'm sorry? Your wife wants to know what kind of drink you're having. Ah, let's say sherry. Okay. One, two, three, sherry. sherry. Comical. Yes. Chloe... Maybe you can help me understand something. Oh, boy. I'll give it a shot. Oh, boy. Rose and I... Yay, this is gonna go downhill. Yesterday was so unlike her. What do you suppose <laughs> is going on? Uh... Oh, boy. <gasps> oh, boy. Ah, there's nothing good. I could say in this situation, I'm gonna start with both sides of me and hope that that's the better option. Besides all my bad behavior rubbing off on her, you mean? Hmm. Another joke. You tell me. It seemed like you and Wells were happy to believe that this morning. And you were all too eager to play into our expectations. In my experience, that's a tactic people use Ooh. to cover for okay, something else. Okay, so this else. wasn't a bad this wasn't Rachel a bad choice. Rachel is her own person. She's responsible for her actions. His voice really bothers me though. I, I really wish he had said gone I with something have else about for the your friendship. But perhaps you're exactly who Rachel needs right now as she navigates the choppy waters of adolescence. Hmm. Okay. Uh Thanks. Okay, that did not go nearly as bad as I thought it was gonna go. Okay, cool. He's drinking sherry. Uh, we're gonna go go talk to Rose, and yes, I hope Chloe? this gets a little less awkward. The boss man would like a sherry. Thank you. The glasses yeah. are in the china cabinet. Okay. You can place one at his setting. How am I supposed to get to China? Kidding. <laughs> oh. It's the fancy <laughs> cabinet. <right? laughs> you got she it. doesn't get her jokes. This is so uncomfortable. <laughs> it feels so awkward right now. I want to leave. Oh, I'm so glad we're leaving. Uh, oh. It's the triangle shaped one. What? Basic shapes. <laughs> now you're speaking my language. Oh, that one. Okay. Head of the table, I believe. That's where we should uh, set that glass. Right. Okay. Did you just rub her butt on it? Why would you do that? That's not how you make a good impression. 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 Okay. Okay. We're gonna speak to you. We're gonna avoid touching anything else yes, that I don't know. Uh. Is there more? What else? <laughs> Feel like I'm getting good at this. Only one last step. As okay. our guest, you may do the honor of lighting the candles. The lighter is in the- It's cool. I've got my own. Oh. You never know when you'll yeah. need to light a candle. Right? Maybe you should miss a paragon that. of preparedness. Thanks. Thank you! I think. I think that's a good thing. Time to light some candles and- Bless this joint up a bit. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna avoid saying anything else because I really just don't 
I don't want anything to blow up in my face right before we leave. I feel like if we do this, maybe we can change the entire first game. <laughs> Probably not, but it's a hope. I'd like to not wind up dead. Um, or Rachel Amber, Amber for her to wind fire. up dead. What could possibly go wrong? Uh-oh. Oh, I was like, are we going to light the house on fire this time? That would not be good. Oh, it's so uncomfortable. Oh my gosh. Uh, okay. So, Please. Chloe, Please. are you and Rachel in any of the same classes? Uh, I wish. I wish. Rachel's all honors. I'm still trying to get into remedial... What's it called? Vocabulary. What oh, okay. about that fire? <laughs> <clears throat> Dinner's really good, Mom. Thank you, Rachel. She doesn't really look very much like her the mother. The way the fire spreads so fast, I've never heard of anything like it. That's strange. Uh, it's almost surreal. They say a fire like that could only come from a crime of passion. Passion? What does that mean? I don't know. You tell me. Ooh. No, Chloe, no, don't do it! You're the DA. Oh, no! Of course. It's certainly troubling. The latest report from the commissioner's office suggests arson. Okay. Arson. Why would anyone do that? Mm, passion. Any number of reasons. With everything going on in the world today, even a town like Arcadia Bay isn't immune to the ills of society. Oh boy. Like I you're cannot imagine Ill, how or... difficult these last few years have been for you, Chloe. Now that you and Rachel have become friends, I want you to know that our home is always open to you. Oh, thank you. Cool. That's very nice, except for Thanks. Stealing your daughter well room said, leave night and... It's imperative in such troubled times as these that we remember what is most important. Oh, he's so gross. Family. Family's not merely a gift. It is a responsibility. <sighs> as such, those we love must be cared for and never, ever taken for granted. Oh, we're gonna calm Rachel. I don't want this to blow up. <clears throat> uh... <laughs> Yeah, that's super true. Uh, and also remember, Rachel, that even when shit's like the lamest ever, you can always run away from whatever's bothering you. As long as you just keep calm. Come on. An interesting philosophy, Chloe. Yes. Yes, indeed. Okay. Not one that, that was a I good choice. Endorse, I feel good however, about that one. I favor confronting my problems head on. Oh, and this is well, where it's about to... Uh... Oh, fucking blowny. Oh, boy. Rachel. Oh, that did not work. Uh, explain! Uh, uh, that's just a little inside joke we have together. Uh, no, <laughs> you blow me, Rachel. Yeah, come um, on. Stop. Oh, boy. I can't sit here and listen to this bullshit anymore. Rachel! Stop oh, it, Dad. maybe You're that was a bad choice. Okay? I know. You lying, cheating piece of shit, motherfucker. Excuse me? We saw you yesterday at the Overlook. James? Kissing that woman. James. Rachel? Honey, this is you so saw uncomfortable. You saw, I know it's hard, but I need you to trust me. Uh, think we saw? Think we saw? Are you trying to gaslight us? There's no thinking involved. We saw you locking lips with some other woman. Best part is, she and I use the same drug dealer. Well, That's maybe that was up. something that you, you maybe should not, not have mentioned anything about a drug dealer. Maybe should have been tossed out the window. Exactly what kind of person you are from the moment mm. I saw you, and I let my wife's compassion get the better of you. Oh, what kind of person is a that? A delinquent. A broken girl from a broken home. Yeah, that's enough, that's James. Not... I will not have you continue to speak to her like this. Oh no. Oh no, Rachel's about to flip. The house is gonna catch on fire, isn't it? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. 
What's going on now? What are we doing here? Why can't you just tell me the fucking truth? Stop lying! Stop being a politician for one fucking minute! Can't you just be my dad? <gasps> Rachel, that woman you saw, that wasn't my mistress. That was your mother. I knew it! I knew it! Oh my gosh! <gasps> what? Plot twist! Shadow settle on the place that you Oh my gosh! Our minds are troubled I love this song. Okay, I think I know why these parts are all blitzed together like this. I don't think- I think this was done on purpose. Maybe like everything while we're seeing everything, it's still kind of part of a memory. Because we are playing through the past. Either that or I'm the only person that this is happening to and it's just a flaw in, in this. So, maybe. Maybe not. Setting fire to our insides for fun. God, I can't believe it. <gasps> oh my gosh. The lovers that went wrong. Sorry, Mom. Oh my gosh, I'm still like my head is still when you broke my chest. Maybe this will be good. In love, then you are the Who is one. I feel like we talked to her most of us at one point. Bitter, is that one of the other missing girls? Someone. It would make sense. Setting fire to our insides for fun. Oh man. To distract our hearts. It makes so much sense because she looks a lot like Rachel. Wow. Oh, and the fire spreads. These games are so good. Oh my gosh. I can't believe what we just found out. Like this is huge to the story. I mean huge. Like we, I don't, I mean, it makes so much sense now because the personality and, and I was even saying earlier, like she does not look like the woman that's her mom or that we thought was her mom. But why, still regardless, at the end of the day, why would he be going back and kissing the mom, though? I mean, they were, like, making out, making out. I don't know why. Unless his marriage is just for show, and the other woman is the woman that's... But for that long, though, oh, I don't... There's so much that I still just have questions about that, that doesn't quite make sense. It does make sense, though, that they're staying, because now... Uh, Rachel's got unanswered questions. So now I'm assuming she's gonna want to go meet her mom. Somehow that gets... See, but where's the involvement with Mr. Jefferson, though? Because she just flat disappears, and Chloe doesn't know anything about it. Or does she? I, I imagine we have to run into him at some point. I don't think we can not run into Mr. Jefferson because he's such a big key player and Rachel is involved with him in some way. There's also a point I do remember from the first game where Rachel Amber gets taken advantage of by Frank, I believe. So there is still that that we have to play through and she gets, 
I'm, I imagine her mom, her real mom, is probably going to be with the one that gets her involved in all of that. Because I don't think it'll end up being Chloe, because Chloe is already kind of on the fence with him. So I bet, I bet it's going to be something with that. But there's also still two, because Mr. Jefferson is involved with the drug dealing too. So maybe that's the connection there as well. Or maybe her mom is the big tie-in with everything. We might from now on just be going downhill because we do know that Rachel has to go missing. And it ends with Chloe talking to Nathan Prescott and getting shot. We know that. We, we are just missing steps in between because we have to know that from the first game. That's, what, that's where we can get it. Hmm. Oh, man. There's just, there's, my brain doesn't, I'm putting, I'm trying to put things together. It's just a matter of putting them together in order. So here's what we know so far. Now we know that there is a mother involved and it is not the woman that she thinks or she knew to be her mother. We also know that this woman is involved with Frank, who is involved with Chloe. So you've got that triangle there. So Chloe, the mother, and Frank are all ties to... That might be a leap, though. I'm assuming that Mr. Jefferson has ties to all three of these people and is going to show up sooner than we think. I imagine he's probably going to be one of those people who end up showing up last minute to whatever ended up happening with Rachel, Chloe, and Frank when they were on drugs, when they got drugged. Prescott, I think, is going to end up being the one that really takes her to Mr. Jefferson and tries to do everything with the photographs. Because we, when we were playing as Max, um, remember... When we were playing as Max and we were tied to the chair and in that situation he did mention Rachel Amber and that Rachel Amber was like a special gift kind of a thing. So, okay, here's my theory. Here's my, my hypothesis. I think, because I don't think Nathan Prescott would have been involved with Rachel Amber, so I'm going to take him out of the equation. I think that something happens between the mom and Frank that Mr. Jefferson catches wind of, and he's going to show up a lot earlier than we suspect that he will. So I think he's going to show up, that's going to get involved and start pulling away from Chloe, because now she's going to be involved with him, almost as maybe as kind of a father figure because she is having issues with her own dad right now. So I think that's gonna end up happening and she will then trust him, kind of go with him and disappear and he's gonna set it up to look like she went off to chase her dreams in New York or LA or wherever it was that she wanted to go. And that's gonna leave Chloe pestering Nathan Prescott because she knows that, sh that he knows something about it. So she's going to go in and pester him, and that's where the first game then starts, when we get shot. That is my hypothesis. It might change along the way, but I don't think I'm going to be wrong, because these games put so many clues. And at the end of this, there should also be a little video, which I think can concrete some of that. But that's just my idea so far. We'll see what happens. We're gonna go ahead and skip through this. Okay guys, so here are all of our choices. Um, enough people have played so far. I don't know how people are getting the game before it comes out, but some people are. So um, here we are, 82% of people took the blame for Rachel, 62% of people emptied their pockets. Um, we are actually in the minority with giving Damon the money. And obviously 75% of people asked Rachel for for, for a kiss, which is pretty funny. Um, we could have also gotten a tattoo, but I'm pretty happy with the kiss. Yeah, so um, obviously that was that was a big part of it, the kiss. I think most people clearly were pretty excited for that. I'm pretty happy with it. So um, yeah, thank you guys so much for commenting, liking, and subscribing. As always, I will see you in the next one. Bye!